it's Rich Tarani here. We're at CTIA 2010 in Las Vegas. Thanks for watching. On our program today is Scott Cotter, who's the Senior Director of Marketing for Novara. Scott, how are you? Good. How are you, Rich? I'm doing fantastic. Uh, you want to give us a 30-second overview for those uh, people who may not be familiar with your company? Yeah, sure. Novara's been around for about 10 years. And um, what we do is we work with the operator and the mobile industry in general to enable web applications and internet-based services, so uh, data services for smartphones, laptops, and even feature phones uh, to the consumer. So it's a fabulous time right now, and obviously that's a big focus right now at the show. And from where you sit in the network, you always have uh, fascinating uh, data to share. And I know you always have done studies. Yeah, that's right. Three years ago at this show is when I, I first met the company, and one of the things that you told me was that uh, Facebook and other social networking sites were, were the majority of the traffic that you were seeing back then. And you really, I mean, I, I didn't, at the time, I wasn't as familiar with how much traffic social networking was generating, but you were able to predict before most other people realized how much mobile social yeah. networking was going on. So what other information do you have for us? Well, you know, that's an interesting, um, what we've seen is that uh, social networking web 2.0 has definitely hit mobile. And one of the stats that we shared uh, recently near the end of the year was some of the click-through rates on those URL shorteners. So you tweet me, I may not be a mobile web user, but I click through on that link that you gave me and I have just become a mobile web user. And it's activities like that that are causing a tremendous amount of growth in uh, network traffic. And our latest study focuses on just that. It's network traffic. And uh, what we did with this study, we wanted to be a little bit different. There's been a lot of studies that have focused on uh, the growth your networks are going to collapse. You need our solutions and technology. Right. We at Novara took a little bit different approach. What we did is we um, created a model. And what an operator can do is kind of turn the knobs, pull the levers on their network traffic assumptions, penetration rates, utilization, device mix, also plug in their financial uh, aspects like uh, CapEx, OpEx, depreciation. And what this does, this model will then report to them uh, what it's going to look like as far as when are they going to saturate the network, when's the time to upgrade, what's the cost per megabyte, and of course then, um, the Novara aspect of it is if you insert our technology into your network, what kind of cost savings and how does that change the model? How does it change your model? Well, it's you got me. You got me hooked. <laughs> well, what we did is uh, we've got a report that's available on our website. Uh, it's entitled Profiting from the Mobile Data Tsunami, so you can get it on Novara.com. Uh, and we, we took an, a model for an average operator, if there is such a thing, and plug that into the model, and that's what's reported. And some of the things that we see, there are immediate impacts on the existing network. So, for instance, we see that you can uh, reduce over-the-air traffic by about 50 to 60 percent, and we took a mix of netbooks and uh, mobile broadband devices, smartphone and feature phones, assumed a growth rate over five years, um, and saw that type of a savings in network traffic. Um, what this allows you to do is immediately reduce the over-the-air traffic by two to three times. So satisfy two to three times as much bandwidth in users uh, just by dropping Novara's right. technology. Right, right, right. Okay. And when it does come time to make that investment in the network, build out the network, there's impact then as well. You can uh, satisfy uh, the same amount of traffic with probably about half the cell sites and perhaps defer the time to network investment by as much as 18 months for an HSPA network, which is important right now to not get kind of caught off guard with some of this growth that we see hockey sticking. So, so it's compression and things like that that you're doing? Well, you know, that's, it goes far beyond earlier generation compression technologies. Um, Novara's mobile data optimization solution uh, uses network layer, uh, acceleration, also compression, but also the difference here and where we get the biggest bang for the buck is that we employ application layer intelligence uh, to reduce over the air traffic. And so if you're looking at, um, it varies by device, but if you're looking at a feature phone or even a smartphone, you're gonna see probably about a 70, 75%, maybe as high as 90% reduction in over the air traffic. If you're looking at a mobile broadband device, a netbook or a laptop with a dongle, maybe you're gonna be closer to the 40 to 65% rate but uh, overall, it's a tremendous benefit for operators. Great. So final question is, what's next from the company? What can we expect? You know what? We're looking at um, ways to 
uh, improve the experience for users, help operators to create that next generation of their portal and or app store, and really what it is, is using our platform to meld web and applications into an experience that's better for the consumer. We think right now you've got a tremendous fragmentation issue in the market, um, and that, that's for developers for reaching all these different types of handsets, and also for operators to offer ubiquitous services across the handsets. So you're going to see our platform uh, use its cloud-based approach to move some of that intelligence into the network to enable great services, web and WAP, or not WAP, web and app services out to a, a broad audience. Very good. Well, thank you so much for being on the program today and, and uh, sharing some of your time and giving us information about what's going on in the industry. Appreciate okay. it. Thank you, Rich.